Hello, welcome back to the channel. Today we are checking out Through the Night. This is a bullet hell slash survive the night style game. It looks pretty good. The art looks fantastic. That's actually what drew me in from the itch.io page, so I'm excited to see what we're about to get. Quiet sleep. Probably baby mode. We're getting bullied. Are we getting like outright attacked? Did they break my glasses? <gasps> and our teacher hates us? That's so mean. Just teach us better, duh. We're crying. I don't want to tell mom. She's already very sad. Where's our dad? I'm a little suspicious that we got some family problems. Oh. Ooh. What are we doing? I was expecting a tutorial, but... I guess we just need to shine our light on them. We can turn it off. It doesn't do damage when it's turned off, but I don't know. What that means. Wave complete. Completing a wave. When you complete a wave, you usually obtain a random item or a synergy slot. Teddy mama. You obtain an item. Items fight alongside you. You couldn't get their descriptions between waves. Generates bugs that attacks enemies. That's gross. But it looks really cool. It reminds me of Oogie Boogie from um, Nightmare Before Christmas. Trash bags. See, though, it's coming up next on the right. And there was trash bags? Ew. Look at those bugs. Yuck. At least they're fighting for us. Man, imagine being bullied at school and then becoming the bug guy. I guess it's a little bit like Willard from that movie. The guy with the rats. I still don't know if he had like paranormal control. I guess that's the idea in that movie. Get it, bugs. Go, go, go. Burn the trash down. Ew. I am so disgusted, actually. Here we go again. They look really cool, but also horrifying at the same time. Oh, and there's so many of them. Ew. There's so many bags. Go, bugs, go. Kill, murder, maim. Oh, only two. I do like that it just endlessly sounds up bugs. Reminds me a little of Binding of Isaac. You can get an attack fly. It attacks the flies for you. It would be nice to see how many enemies are left old gluey. Emits a strip of goo in the direction of the target that deals damage on impact and slow and apply slow to enemies who step on it. I'm gonna put you together because like, what if the bugs could leave trails? I didn't even look, what are you? Enemies afflicted by slow move at reduced speed. The white number below the enemy's health bar represents the amount of slow applied. Oh, you're bullying classmates, Oh. Was the trash bag meant to signify like, oh, ow. If the lantern touches an enemy or hostile projectile, it gets temporarily disabled. Oh no. Go, bugs, go! Oh, and then you have to manually turn on. I wonder if the trash bags are meant to signify that we were bullied, you know, with the garbage and stuff. Oh shit, I just rammed my light into you. Um. I don't know about the skulls, though. Perish. Go, Lex, go. You're the saving me. You're the one thing holding me down. 
Multiple eyes from multiple staring eyes from the children. Mm. I feel bad for this poor kid. Ah, you're fast. Wave over. You obtained a synergy slot. Synergy slots combine the characteristics of two items, providing a unique additional effect. You can use the left mouse button to pick up and move items. Click the switch to toggle between item descriptions and synergy. Hmm. From the moment a marble is thrown, it begins to accumulate bugs inside, released when destroyed. Marbles temporarily stick to enemies hit, applying slow. I think that's probably best. <gasps> There's a new enemy. Ooh. All right, let's do it, I guess. Bro's got knives. Yeah, it gets slowed on. <gasps> oh. Some enemies shoot projectiles that can damage the lantern. Unlike enemies, hostile projections, projectiles are dangerous for the lantern only. Oh. I see the bullet hell now. I hope it gives me ample time to dodge because I'm bad at game. Die. Okay, yeah. Oh, you can see them charging up. Bullet hell, bullet hell. the bugs are still able to do work even if I'm bad and can't quite follow up. So many of you. I guess this must be the kid dreaming and we're having horrible nightmares about just our classmates, the bullying we've gone through. It would be interesting if our father had died because we could see a lot of like carryover of the horror in um the skulls and like deceased elements and disease. He's just a little guy. Why you gotta bully him? He's got little dark circles under his eyes. He's doing his best. Oh, I didn't realize they just keep spawning. Sheesh. I'm doing all the hard work. I'm just over here glowing. Oh, it's becoming harder and harder. We just gotta move slowly, gently. Our snail is pretty pog, actually. I'm so bad. I rolled my eyes, I'm so bad. Wave over? Wave over! Oh. Items, that's right. Boo Boo. Accumulates up to three electric charges while the lantern is off. Upon turning on the lantern, it releases all charges, damaging all illuminated enemies. Slightly increases the lantern's light. What does this do? Accumulates up to three while the lantern is off, so... You don't synergize that well. Oh, was I looking at the wrong thing? I think I was. All right, we're charging. One, two, three. We're charging. One, two, three. I don't know if I like it. I feel like we can get more damage in when we are just using the light normally. Get away from my bed! It's probably one hit and you're done. Go 
go, buggies, go. I need you to help me. I need to survive. I'm just a little kid. I made it, round one. Oh, these bastards again. Oh. Get away from my bed! Oh my gosh, these are the scariest so far. Part of it's because they look so normal and they're laughing at me. I don't like it. This music is good. I love this. Probably should focus over here too. Oh my god, they're all firing. My bugs are keeping it busy on the left. Oh, my bad. Oh, I like that we still charge when we're, um, dead. You know, maybe the charge isn't so bad. Maybe I'm just impatient. That is a problem for me, is I'm impatient as hell. So, the sting, oh, sling also throws glass shards. Do you want to see what that's like? I didn't get a new, a new one. No new Emony. Hmm. I feel like the slow is so good, but. All right, we got purple trash bags coming up. What are they gonna have? Oh, we're doing like, oop, big area of damage. I think I like that. I'm usually a many but lower damage kind of person. I feel like this is great for this level specifically. If it's always the same enemies each time, it might actually be really nice to have certain enemies for certain waves or certain items for certain waves so you could if you're having a hard time chart it out purple bag get slowed on i'm just having a good time don't mind me they got so fast there! Oh my gosh, they were running! Oh, oh, oh. Don't be purple over there. Okay, thankfully not purple. Focus your attack, sake! Gross. Oh, there's so many of them. These bags are so tanky. Now this one. The slow is really saving me here. Oh, I fucked up. We're survivors. <gasps> New item. Sir Lamp equips the lantern with a spear that pierces enemies. Significantly increases the lantern's light. What happens if I put you here? Oh, it's a synergy slot too. 
thunder ring. Um, when the lantern is on, a ring of electricity surrounds it. Damaging enemies it touches increases the attack speed of the sling. Mmm. Hmm. I like that here. The thunder ring. I think we'll go with this. Oh, a sphere. Holy shit. This is fun! Oh, ow. Freaking heck. I'm doing quite a bit of damage. Oh, I need to focus on the middle. And they're coming in from the right! I didn't look at what was coming up, so I don't even know what's after this wave. Oh. You didn't see that. That's my bad. Scary skulls, I guess. We gotta rotate, rotate, sucker, rotate! Wasn't paying attention when I got got. Oh. Well, with this, like, electric ability, at least, you know, when I'm out, I'm not dead. Okay, let's charge. Oh, I can look like to stab, pierce. I'll give you. Are you purple? I think you're purple. I'm scared. And there are just random ones coming in. Rigged. Get shrapneled. I'm surprised I've never heard of this before. This is really fun. I like this. I don't know if it's finished, if it was maybe just a one-off game. But this is great. I could play a lot of this. It reminds me a little bit of this game that came out some time ago, which was kind of like a Binding of Isaac clone where you play as like this young character within an orphanage and there's tons and tons of enemies that you have to fight through. There's teachers, there's other students who are enemies, tons of stuff, really. If I can remember the name of it, I'll put it in the itch.io. If I can remember the name of it, I will put it in the description down below, but it's been a long, it's like my dark something, I think. If you know what I'm talking about, remind me. I think I have it on Steam, but who knows if I can find it. Um, okay, did not get a new item. So up next, we have more of the same, but different colors, so stronger. Scary. Oh, it's you again. Oh, and you fire projectiles. Oh, oh, when you put your thingy up, it's bad. Bad news bears. It would be interesting if you fired in different directions based on where you're pointing. Oh, oh, oh. We'll delete the top row. Go, flies, go! Don't let them win! We gotta protect our boy! Thankfully that means I can just stay to the one side of them and be okay. Expecting them to like start spitting up random things that aren't these little roaches. Like, what if they have their own flies? Oh, ow. I just feel like it doesn't do that much damage to these really tanky ones. Did he die? <gasps> Yay, he's so peacefully through the night! Yay! Oh my gosh, good job, us! 
Mm-mm-mm-mm-mm-mm. Bring me in somewhere sleeping. Do we have a sibling? A dad? Maybe? His mom? <gasps> Press to continue. Our lantern has cute little sleepy eyes. <gasps> oh. Okay, so we can do restless sleep next. Who's this? A message from the developer. Hello, I'm Eric, the creator of this game. Thank you so much for trying through the night. This project was primarily born as a personal challenge to successfully develop in a few months a small but polished game, creating every asset from scratch and learning all of the necessary skills along the way. Before embarking on this adventure, my experience was limited to game art. All other aspects of game development fascinated me, but I had never put them into practice. After seven challenging months of development, Through the Night was almost ready, and thanks to the valuable contributions of Gabrielle and Rosanna, I was able to complete it to the best of my abilities. So thank you again for being here. It means a lot to me. I can't wait to hear your thoughts. Wow! For being made by one person with some help, this is phenomenal. It's great. I love the art style. I love the different enemies. I love the different enemies. I love the synergy of the items. I feel like you could do so many different things. I wonder if you get more items as you play in the other modes. I think we'll stop the video here for today, but if you're interested, let me know and I will come back and I will do the other two modes. Maybe it's one big long video. This is great. I'm surprised that it's someone's first game. I am blown away. Soundtrack, illustrations, and then you did everything. Sheesh, that's crazy. Oh, playtesters, that's cute too. Uh, I think the only thing that I am personally missing is a little more of a story, but we definitely get those elements while playing, the pictures at the beginning, and then um, I think you can really pull quite a bit of meaning from the different enemies that you're facing along the way, which definitely helps to add more feeling of story and narrative here. I'm just someone who loves story and games, so the gameplay is pretty solid. I like it. I think you have enough synergy items going on to want to play multiple times, too. So it makes a big difference um, compared to some of the games that I've played that are like this, but maybe not as well developed, which is saying a lot for someone who learned all of the skills to make this within a seven month window of time. Sans the art, but you know, <sighs> wow, this is this is great. Anyway, enough of my rambling. That has been it for this game for now. If you would like to play yourself, definitely do. If you want to see me play more, I absolutely would. So tell me. Okay, that's it for the video. Thank you so much for watching. Bye-bye.